Thank you. Hi, I'm Steve Strauss, small business expert and USA Today columnist. I'm partnering with Bank of America to provide resources and guidance to help small businesses succeed and grow. In this segment of Big Ideas for Small Business, we're going to take a look at common business themes that emerged following my conversations with several small business owners over the course of this past year. One of the overarching strategies small business owners discussed is maintaining a personal connection with customers. And this is true whether we're talking about identifying the right audience, networking, marketing, or what have you. According to Bank of America's inaugural small business owner report, 47% of small business owners identified marketing as their most important priority for generating more customers. Here are the key tips we've heard over the course of the year. Get to know your target audience. Small business owner Beverly East believes that advances in technology have enabled small businesses to stay in one place and yet establish meaningful relationships with customers and that's without ever having to leave your desk. And while this is true, it's equally important to get out of the office and make sure that you interact with customers in the real world. According to Oris Stoll, small business owners actually have an advantage in this regard. You can easily find out where your customers meet and go there. Attend industry events, networking events, conferences, meetings, that sort of thing. Brian Kelly suggests that you examine how you communicate with customers. Even something as simple as a friendly greeting or getting to know your customers personally goes a really long way. Another tip we heard, connect with customers in real time. Philip McKenzie says there are a variety of ways to maintain a running dialogue with your customers online, and what's great is most of them are free. For example, here is Phil's Twitter feed. But as we all know, there's all sorts of other options available. LinkedIn, Facebook, YouTube, and yet. According to findings from Bank of America's Small Business Owner Report, it turns out that despite the allure of social media marketing, surprisingly, only 39% of small business owners use social to engage in conversations with customers. That's a missed opportunity. And only 47% use social to provide discounts and deals, and typically, those are the best practice. Finally, another key tip we heard was to offer not just good value, but exceptional value. Look, nobody likes to be constantly sold to, and so the best way to make a casual customer into a loyal one is to refrain from constantly selling to them. Instead, step outside the box and determine ways that you can deliver added value to that customer. For example, Carissa Reininger goes through her client list and brainstorms one connection, resource, or tip that she thinks could be beneficial to her clients. Now that I've offered you some tips from your fellow small business owners, I'd like to leave you with a few thoughts of my own. First, create a new recipe. Don't just stick to approaches that are tried and true. Businesses that grow continue to test out and incorporate new practices and then add them into the menu. Second, emphasize your X factor. What sets your business apart? What do you do that is unique and different and special? Knowing what your X factor is is critical because it is what allows people to remember your business above the din. If you want to grow, figure out your X factor and emphasize it. Next, have a vision. Great businesses, big and small alike, are focused on a lot more than just making money. Having a vision for your business gives employees a bigger purpose, and maybe more importantly, it helps you understand where you want to go. Finally, create a board of advisors. Who do you know that can help your business grow? Contact these folks and ask them to be part of your unofficial board of advisors. You can ask for feedback, see what they can do to help you, and find out who they know that can help your business grow. Also, and equally important, don't undervalue the importance of networking with other small business owners. Have certain business strategies increased your revenue or led to new customers for your business? If so, and you're a small business owner, we want to hear from you. Stop by Bank of America's Small Business Community. That's www.smallbusinessonlinecommunity.bankofamerica.com and network with other small business owners.